Something very, very strange is happening on the planet right now. And in private conversations with other individuals, I have had a confirmation of something that is being seen all around the world. Many people are too afraid to come forward and say anything about it because it's so disturbing. But in today's video, we're going to talk about this. And I'm going to ask my audience, have you seen this same thing happening? There is a number that is appearing everywhere, and I don't think it's a coincidence. No matter where I look or the folks that I've talked to have looked, they keep seeing the number 13 and they cannot explain it. Wait until I show you all of the different examples. Something's going on. And the reason I started with this image, how many of you knew that the Great Pyramid in Egypt was built on 13 acres and has 13 separate, different stone courses inside it. That's just the beginning. Real quick, though. Battlefield of the mind. Sometimes things happen by coincidence, but when too many things happen in such a succession so quickly, it's not a coincidence. Many people don't believe in them, and I don't blame them, because there are a great many things going on that we just are unaware of, or we're only slightly aware of, and it's too easy these days to get caught up in our emotions and dismiss them and not even bother to take time to think about it. Now, if you'd like to join us, help support the channel, I could sure use it these days. I'll be very honest. We talk about psychological operations over at the Florida Maki Patreon channel and other things as well. And we take the gloves off and we don't pull any punches. It's not really allowed here anymore on YouTube. That's why I had to set up the channel over there. If you'd like to join us, it's only a dollar. Only one single U.S. dollar per month, and even less if you sign up for an entire year. And here's the best part. It's fully refundable. For the first 90 days, you'll get full access over there. There's a handful of videos over there set up for the folks who have decided to step up and contribute $5 a month. But trust me, you're going to want to watch the dollar videos first before you go down that road, because that's another level of gloves off. Love to have you over there. Like I said, fully refundable, first 90 days, no questions asked. Let's get right to it. Now, I'm sure some of you might have seen this image, and it's a fairly simple place to start. The two images that you're seeing on the left and the right were found 13,000 kilometers apart, one in Brazil and one in India. They were digging around through caves and found strange paintings on these walls, and that's not uncommon. But when they realized that in Brazil and in India, there were people making the same image using the same colors 8,000 years ago, they knew something was up. Now, what these images are is there's a centralized point and then there are 13, in both images, basically nodes with lines drawn straight to that center point. Now, for me, this is too much of a coincidence by itself that 13,000 kilometers apart, you have a centralized figure and 13 nodes around it. But it gets even better than that. It gets even better than that. It kind of piqued my interest because there's been this discovery made recently of a very special shape that when you put it together, it's basically, if you can think of the shape of a kite, if you take eight of them and you put them together in this pattern, they, they tessellate or they um, lay out in a pattern in a grid that never repeats. From theory to reality, mathematicians prove existence of 13 cited shape called the hat. A group of mathematicians led by David Smith identifies a shape called the hat that can tile a surface without repetition, an occurrence that only existed in theory before. And this has 13 sides to it. Now, this all by itself, okay, interesting, Maquis, but um, doesn't really show anything that is relative to anything that's going on in my life. But what made me think of the number 13 was Jesus had 12 disciples. 
himself and 12 others make 13. For the vast majority of my life, I thought there were 12 constellations in the Zodiac, but recently they came out and said, no, no, there are 13. They added one called Ophiuchus, the serpent. Now, remember that. So there are 13 constellations in the sky now, as opposed to 12. This is something I only learned recently. The moon moves 13 degrees around the earth every day. It takes 13 days to change from full moon to new moon, and then 13 days to change back, with one day at full moon and one day at new moon, equaling 28 days of the lunar cycle. Hmm, that's interesting. And each of them has apparently a tone. Magnetic moon, lunar moon, electric moon, self-existing moon. This might or might not be the case. But what is the case, and is fact, that on turtles, you can track 28-day, 13-month lunar cycles. Around the edge of a turtle shell, there are 28 plates on all turtles. And in the center there are 13 larger plates on all turtles. So now we have quite a few disparate things all pointing to the number 13. The Aztecs believed that there were 13 heavens of space and time. Okay, that's fairly interesting. How many of you knew there were 13 major joints in the body? Two ankles, two knees, two hips, two wrists, two elbows, two shoulders, and the spine. Thirteen. How many of you knew that in witchcraft, for there to be a complete coven, it consists of thirteen individual witches? And so that I don't get demonetized, I will try to say this in as succinct a way as I can. What age is it that our sweet, innocent little uh, young'uns start to become not so sweet and not so innocent? I believe it is in the Jewish um, canon that 13 is the age that a young boy is no longer a young boy, and he is now a man, bar mitzvah. Now, here's where it gets really odd. Trump rebukes Harris and Biden on anniversary of Afghanistan bombing that killed 13 service members. August 26, 2024. What happened on July 13th of this year? July 13th. August 21st. Harris builds 13-point lead over Trump with women. You see, that's kind of the thing about 13, is that 13 is actually a sign of the what they call the divine feminine. Taylor Swift, I'm very annoying about a lot of things in my life, but the thing I'm most annoying about is the number 13. See, she has some fixation with this number to the extent that she tattoos it all over her body. And how much have we heard lately about uh, both sides of the political spectrum wanting her endorsement? Sacred 13, Rise of the Divine Feminine, unleashing the power of, you remember that 13th uh, zodiac sign? The power of a fucus. The power of a fucus. How many of you knew there were 13 feminine seduction archetypes? 13 different ways men are powerless. Siren, boss, enigma, diva. Every guy has a type, at least according to Mr. Trump, too. Of course, I'm sure most are like, you haven't even talked about the origins of Friday the 13th. Many don't realize celebrating the sacred feminine. Something that we've talked about at this channel for a while. The scripture in the Bible that talks about the woman seated upon the beast. Something very strange is going on, and it circles around the number 13, and I can't put my finger on it yet, but the fact, 
And let's see if I can pull this up real quick. The fact that the two locations where they found those very odd cave paintings, one here, and I'm not even going to try to say this name, state of P-I-A-U-I. Piauí, state of Piauí, Brazil. If you draw a straight line, across Africa, Saudi Arabia, to where they found the exact same symbol in a place called Dulatpur in India is exactly 13,000 kilometers. Something very, very strange is happening. And like I said, I've had private conversations with folks about this, and they have confirmed this, that they had been seeing this all over the place. Something very, very weird is going on. And I wish I had a great explanation for it. Discuss down in the comments. What do you think it is? How many different things can line up before it's no longer a coincidence? And to me, this is a staggering coincidence. That in Brazil on the left and India on the right, that 8,000 years ago, 8,000 years ago, 13,000 kilometers away from each other, two different, completely different and disparate groups of people scrawled the exact same image on a cave wall. Many have said, Florida Maki, you sit around and you draw lines all over maps and you, you call it this, that, and the other. Apparently, I'm not the only one. Apparently, 8,000 years ago, there are some folks who got the same idea. Which to me is very, very, very strange. Here's the article. Um, let's see if we can translate this real quick. More than 14,000. Well, they say 14,000 here. These two, But I measured it out and it's 13,000. So both with 13 vectors seem to converge toward the center. 13 vectors that converge toward the center. Some strange shape now that they've recently discovered that tiles infinitely. Jesus had 13 disciples. There are now 13 signs in the Zodiac where there used to be only 12. 13 degrees of moon movement. 13 lunar cycles every year. Most of the women probably know that for a very specific reason. A cycle that you can track on the back of a turtle. All turtles, everywhere. The Aztecs just decided 13 was the number. 13. 13 heavens of space and time. 13 major joints in the body. 13 witches in a coven. 13 years and all of a sudden, something happens. Let's leave that there. 13 service members in Afghanistan. July 13th, this happens. 13-point lead over Trump with women. And Taylor Swift, the entertainer to end all entertainers, for lack of a better term, I guess. Number 13 all over body. Rise of the Divine Feminine. 13 seduction archetypes for the women. Sacred Feminine, Friday the 13th. Very, very strange. I wish I could explain it. And the Great Pyramid, sitting on 13 acres with 13 different stone courses inside. What do you think? Join us, Battlefield of the Mind. Would love to hear from you guys. I really would on this. I can't say that I have necessarily some great, you know, explanation on this, but there are a lot of things out there that perhaps we shouldn't waste our energy trying to understand, but definitely watching. Not getting too uh, upset about it, I guess, because there's not very much we can do about it. When it spans something this great, 
it's just, to my mind, the best thing you can do is just accept the fact that there are certain things not meant to be understood by our minds, but acknowledge their existence and that they're real. Love to have you. And these days, I know a dollar doesn't sound like much, but with 129,000 subscribers, if I even had single digit, single digit percentages of my subscribers here at Patreon, it'd be life changing. One dollar. That's it. One dollar a month is all it would take. Can you help? I could sure use it. God bless. Pray for each other. Pray for me. I'll pray for you. Lift each other up. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.